The possibility of a younger Morpheus in the next Matrix movie continues to grow in notoriety. The character that actor Yahya Abdul-Mateen II is going to play has yet to be disclosed, but we still believe that it could be young Morpheus. As we mentioned in our time travel video, there is another possibility of how a young Morpheus can appear in the next movie. We have already seen the multiple leaked videos from the set of the movie. We've seen Keanu Reeves' character, Neo, acting as if he doesn't remember who he is, that he lost his memories of his past. But what if this original assumption is wrong? What if the Neo that we saw in those leaks is not the one from the original trilogy, but from an earlier version of the Matrix? Welcome to Matrix Explained. Welcome to the desert of the real. Before we begin today's video, we would like to announce our first official giveaway for our subscribers. We will be raffling a copy of the Matrix Comics 20th Anniversary Edition, an anthology of all published Matrix comic book stories, some written by the Matrix creators themselves, the Wachowskis. All you have to do to win is be a subscriber to this channel, leave a like on this video, and leave a comment on who is your favorite Matrix character and why. The winner will be announced on August 29th, 2020. Thank you for the support and enjoy today's video. To better understand this theory, we must first know about the different versions of the Matrix. We have already talked about the multiple versions of the Matrix in depth in a previous video. Please check it out if you want to know more. We don't know for sure how many versions of the Matrix have existed, but the architect counts the versions from the first appearance of the anomaly, or the one, onwards. The Matrix is older than you know. I prefer counting from the emergence of one integral anomaly to the emergence of the next, in which case this is the sixth version. In the original Matrix trilogy, he counts six anomalies, six versions of the Matrix. Yet we know of three other versions without the anomaly. The Pre-Beta, Paradise Matrix, and the Nightmare Matrix. That makes nine versions of the Matrix, but we're going to focus on the versions with the anomaly, the ones that the architect counts. Naturally, with everything we knew so far, we've assumed that the Matrix 4 was going to be a sequel, a continuation after the events of Matrix Revolutions. The return of Keanu Reeves and Carrie Ann Moss made it easy to believe that. However, what if this new movie, which still does not have an official title, is a prequel to the original Matrix from 1999. Morpheus is one of the wisest and also one of the most mysterious characters in the entire trilogy. Much of his story and past is still unknown. He spent much of his life looking for the one person who will save humanity, the one that can manipulate the Matrix and save Zion. With all due respect, Commander, there is only one way to save our city. How? Neo. But how did Morpheus knew about the One? He seems to know more about the One than what was told to him. He knows far more than any other human in Zion. It is a known fact that the Oracle was the one who told Morpheus about the One. She was the one who put the prophecy in his head. The story of a supposed savior who can manipulate the Matrix. But what if we misunderstood? Morpheus explains the prophecy to Neo in this scene in the first Matrix. When the Matrix was first built, there was a man born inside who had the ability to change whatever he wanted. It was he who freed the first of us. So according to Morpheus, there was a person who, like Neo, was capable of manipulating the Matrix and was the one who liberated the first humans. Morpheus was a fundamental piece for the finding of Neo, and was the one who set him on the path of becoming the One. The Oracle prophesied that he would find the One who would save humanity. Going back to the theory of Matrix 4 being a prequel, if actor Yahya Abdul-Mateen II is going to play Morpheus, this could mean that Morpheus is a creation of the Matrix, a program created to find and guide the One. 
With five previous versions of the One, there could have been five versions of Morpheus. Remember what the architect said. While it remains a burden assiduously avoided, it is not unexpected and thus not beyond a measure of control, which has led you inexorably here. Although Neo was an anomaly, it was somewhat predictable, and the architect had created methods to keep the One under control. One of these methods could have been to use Morpheus through the Oracle, guaranteeing that the anomaly would fulfill its purpose, all for the ultimate goal of rebooting the Matrix. But how can Morpheus be a creation of the machines? Well, like Neo, Morpheus could have appeared in each version of the Matrix with the anomaly. Perhaps he is a type of cloned program designed to follow certain parameters. If Morpheus is a creation of the Matrix, this means that the new movie could occur during the first appearance of the Anomaly, the first appearance of the One. Maybe this cycle is much deeper than what was explained. Not only are the events repeating, but some key people as well. As Morpheus once told Neo, she told you exactly what you needed to hear. The Oracle. She told me She I told you exactly what you needed to hear. That's all. Referring to the Oracle, she can prophesize exactly what's going to happen because it had already happened before. Morpheus risked his life for Neo. He always finds the one. We could very well see on screen the first Matrix anomaly, a young Morpheus finding the first Neo, a late bloomer version of Neo explaining why he looks older than Morpheus. Maybe we will see the birth of Agent Smith and the foundation of the city of Zion. This is all of course theoretical. Matrix 4 has a higher chance of being a sequel rather than a prequel. Though a movie about the first anomaly in the Matrix would be interesting to watch. Much more interesting than what was in the plot leak that we covered not long ago. But do you agree? Could Matrix 4 be a prequel or would you rather it be a sequel? For Matrix Explained, please leave a like and subscribe. And thank you for visiting the Desert of the Real.